More than 48 hours after a historic storm brought monster sized hail to South Baldwin County Saturday morning, residents, insurance agents, and auto repair and body shops are all busy. And as our Chad Petrie shows us tonight, the hail is delaying some tourist trips home. Rob Chambers extracts a battered windshield from a Michigander's car. I took out a lot of cars, a lot of people on vacation from Minnesota. You, you name it, and they all call and they just want to get back home. They just want to glass in the car to get back home. Chambers says on a normal day, he gets seven calls, but Monday, it was more than 200. While it's good to be busy, he says he feels for those now dropping everything for repairs. Because I was just on vacation, and we was thinking, you know, if we got stranded where we was at, it's, uh, it's, it's, you know, it's not good. It's a big hassle. There's plenty of work, but one of the challenges right now is there's not enough new glass to fill all the orders coming up. The warehouses are trying to deliver it as fast as they can. That, that was the bad thing is that it happened over the weekend and the, the, the windshield uh, vendors were all closed on the weekend. In Orange Beach, the lingering damage from giant balls of ice can still be seen on vehicles. Really bad, man. We've been cleaning up for like three days. Some drivers tell me the damage is so bad the vehicle is totaled by insurance, costing more to fix than the vehicle is valued. Hendricks hopes he's not one of them. Yeah, they definitely should. Full coverage. I'm going to be upset if they don't. An extreme weather event with extreme damage. In Orange Beach, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.